Hi, I'm Phil Bridges, owner of Straight Arrow Repair. Ever want to know how a repairman fixes things? Well, come with me and I'll show you how I solve problems. Let's make things better together. This is how much work we did if you want to go by the pile of flooring that we tore out is a lot. Um, it's a little bit of carpet pad that was in the closet. Uh, it's This job did not go like I wanted it to, but it did go good. Let's go take a look at it. Originally, we thought we were just going to have to replace part of the hallway. We did a lot more than what we thought. We replaced all the bad parts of the bathroom here. Quite a journey. Sealed everything. Everything sealed up. It's clay. Then we end up having to do some right here in the doorway. The more we walked on it, the more the worse it got. And then we were asked to see what was going on with this area. So we put in two bys and this is a bit quarter plywood. not to have to replace more than what we need to to keep this lady in a budget but we end up having to replace all this because it, the more you walked on it the more it was obvious it was going to collapse so we end up having we had first thought well we were just going to stay in the bathroom then it was just this far and then just and we did and in the closet the most miserable room this place this area right here could smell up the whole house by itself. The carpet has so much poop and pee on it. Uh, and then you can see right here, the lows ran out of this material in this whole area all the way 40 miles. Was, you have to go almost 60 miles to get this material now. They say they got 200 sheets coming to the lows that we're at which is the largest in northwest arkansas maybe arkansas but anyway we went to this which is more expensive and in my mind this is not quite as good because this plywood can get wet several times and i've seen it several times get wet and this starts to delaminate when it gets wet both of these are better than particle board. board by a long long ways we're still going to do floor leveler on all the seams and everything uh, but the last time i talked to them they uh were listening to the older gentleman who's 10 years older than me and he was saying oh carpet's cheaper that's not learning because carpet does not hold up well to renters. They don't, a lot of times the renters do not care about your expense. Uh, and I'm not sure that any kind of decent carpet is not more expensive than regular flooring, which you can clean and shovel out in this case. But anyway, I'm waiting to see how much of this they're going to put in carpet before I go leveling it all out. Uh, they don't seem to care. Uh, but I also had to leave this job to go to another one. It was not planned. This was not in my schedule. Uh, so my thing is we'll just delay this and then we'll see what happens when I come back in a week or so. And if they got somebody else to do it, so be it. Uh, I'm wearing the shiny hat. I, so you, so you look at my eyes yeah. and not down here at my... Miami Heat the jersey uh, or jacket. But anyway, hope you uh, followed us along to so you can pick up and learn what you can do yourself. I did not take you around every minute. Um, 
but there are jobs where I've shown you every little instance of what we did. And if you want to get even more detail on how I cut every board and how I cut the wood and, and uh, how I put the screws in, uh, there is even much, much more detailed uh, videos also. But this is an example of what you can do with a house that you bought or a house that you have as rental or just maintaining the one you have because of a water heater overflowing or uh, a sink busting, things like that. This is what you yeah. can do when you have tornadoes and snow. In the same right, way. it can be bad. Now in here, what they did was overlay. You see this seam right here? See how that tile right there on my foot broke? That's what it'll do if you overlay. So, see you guys later. It's Phil Bridges. If you like what you saw, you think it might be helpful to somebody else, push that like button and let other people know what you and I now know. And we'll work together toward making a brighter future. And by the way, we're not Americans, we're Americans. See you next time.